Hi, it's Jeff with Sunnyland Patio. Today I'd like to show you how to clean your sling furniture. Welcome to my shop. To complete this task, we just need some mild detergent. You know, like a Dawn dishwashing detergent works well, and I like to add some bleach to it also. So try and use the ratio of about a quarter cup of the detergent, mild soap, uh, and about a cup of bleach to each gallon of water. Uh, some other items that can be useful when cleaning your furniture, a sponge, uh, a soft brush like this, and then one that I like a lot is these uh, car wash bits. They, they work real well and you're able to, uh, to get around the whole frame all in one shot rather than having to use the sponge on one side and then the other. So to get started, we're just pretty much going to rinse off of our furniture. I like to put it on the fabric first so that that way it's uh, kind of soaking in and getting between the fibers while I'm working on the rest of the piece of furniture. So I take care of the, uh, the top surface and then take the extra time to go right behind it and get all you can, all the, the fabric that's visible. And then underneath the bottom we're going to go also here. So pretty simple, pretty quick to cover that whole sling. And then while you're here, you should be, go ahead and wash the rest of your frame. You know, cleaning helps a lot to, to prolong and not age your furniture as much. So you need to keep your investment going for, uh, for more time. So we'll finish wiping off the frame underneath. And now's a good time too to inspect your caps. See if you need any new caps. You know, we carry a lot of those parts if you ever need any. And finish off the frame and the rail and then we put a little bleach in that water so I like to let it soak in a few minutes um, this chair is looking pretty good already I don't have any mildew so we don't have to worry about soaking it in any longer to get rid of the mildew um, so normally you'd wait about five minutes and then do a good rinse job you want to be careful about this when we've used the bleach products we want to make sure we rinse off the frame super well because uh, if, if not, it doesn't hurt the material usually too much, but it can eat that stitching away and cause your slings to, to not last as long or to start you know, bursting a little sooner. So make sure you take the time and rinse the, the chair really well. Comes out looking pretty great now. Um, if you want to take it a step further and you have a smooth finish on your chairs, you can even use like a liquid auto polish and, uh, and rub that on and then wipe it off to remove the excess. Uh, always test the spot before you do this. If your frame is textured at all, sometimes that wax doesn't come off, so you kind of create a mess if that's the case. So you only want to do that on a smooth finish. Well, I think this chair came out looking pretty nice. In a few minutes it'll be dry and ready to sit in. Thanks for watching.